All right, so we are live at the Karababa Beach Hotel today. We're really excited to be here. It's the fourth, fourth year anniversary. Uh, I mean, fourth edition of the West Sahalad um, Awards, and I'm your host, Maria Makuli. Consistently, I've been here four years now, being the red carpet host, where we will talk to your favorite celebrities, media personals and lots more who would come in here today to celebrate with us. I'm not alone on the red carpet. My co-host this year is Alvin. What's up? Hello, good evening, everybody. <laughs> Hello, Mariama. It is indeed a great honor to grace this red carpet with you. Well, for the first time, but I'm looking forward to a lovely night. You look I'll great. Look at that bow tie, though. Oh, thank you. Thank you. <laughs> well, at least I know how to fix one properly. You look great as he well. He said he knows how to fix one properly. That's interesting. <laughs> So I got fixed up by Swag Corner Say, who is a young entrepreneur who's into tailoring, fashion designing as well. She did this entirely beautiful outfit. Thank you Amazing so much, work. Say. Take, check her out, Swag, Swag Corner. And um, makeup was done by Auntie, who is at the Carnifing Estate. But this year, we will be celebrating victory. We will also be celebrating a new face in the Gambian music industry, entertainment industry to be specific. A lot has gone on in 29, I mean 2018. A lot of interesting drama, a lot of interesting hard work also. And we saw a total new face of performance in the Gambia. So we'll be celebrating with lots of artists today, not just to honor them, but also to celebrate their hard work. What have you noticed over the past few years with the Gambian showbiz? Well, Mariama, like they say, achievements are more enjoyable when they are celebrated. Uh, for the past year, there have been a lot of achievements, a lot of breakthroughs. This 2018, 2018 indeed, it was the Litmus paper test for the scene and it turned out positive. Definitely. Positive. So what you're going to do right now is talk to some few people on the red carpet. People are already coming in. So we're going to start talking to few people, ask them how they feel about tonight and they're, what they're looking forward to. We have a gentleman. Welcome. How are you doing? Good evening, sir. Stand right here. <laughs> What's your name? Uh, my name is Swiss Adama, Adama Sumundu, whatever you can call me. Amadou Sumundu, what are you looking forward to this year's award? Uh, it's a good, it's a good, it's a good platform. Like currently, it's the Gambia, it's the Gambia's only um, award event, so it's a good thing. Uh. All right, enjoy. So, Adama, how does it feel to be nominated on this award? Uh, I feel great. At least, at the, after 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 all the hard work, it's been recognized. So that's uh, that's a that's a that's a great thing. So it's a great feeling for this is your first award nomination right this is the third time third one in a row yeah Whoa. yeah great congratulations to good you. luck appreciate it <laughs> all right he's a nominee and we wish him great luck tonight we have another gentleman as well come on let's talk to you how you doing good evening and welcome evening, to the sir. wasahala music award what's your name my name is uche zamani Uche, what are you expecting tonight on this award ceremony? Well, I have a lot of expectations, but God is the ultimate decider. So whatever or however the award turns out, I'm just grateful to God. At least being here is a lot. Being here is a lot. Uche made it. He's nominated on the category of Music Producer of the Year. And we're looking forward to you winning and celebrating. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. Being a producer for the past few years, what has been the most exciting moment for you working with Gambian artists? Uh, the rapid increase in the mentality of Gambian music amongst Gambian artists. That's, that's everything. That's the whole excitement. And I'm happy. Thank you so much and we wish you great luck. Thank you so much. All right, we're still here live at the Caraba Beach Hotel fourth Wasahalat Music Award. Uh, a big congratulations to Yasalin Jai and ENC and her entire team for being consistent over the past four years. I think consist consistency is key with whatever you are doing. We've seen a whole lot of people start award shows which eventually did not yes, happen again, but yes. Wasahalat Award, four years in a row, consistency and 
they've been giving us great, great, great Definitely. award nights. I guess we have someone else on standby that we need to talk to. Hello. Good evening. Great. Good evening, sir. So what is your name? RJ Mahdi. RJ Mahdi. What do you do, sir? Uh, well, uh, I'm a repatriate, so I moved back uh, to the continent from the United States. Oh, beautiful. So I've been living here for five years, and we do media that uh, shows the world the beauty of Africa. So that's why we're here tonight to support the artists and to, you know, show the rest of the world that, you know, they're, they're a talented artists here uh, that, you know, deserves that kind of worldwide recognition. Is this your first time here on this particular event? Yeah, this is my first time at the Waxahala Awards. Yeah, uh, but I've been to Gambia many times. I love Gambia. So what do you think of the Gambian music entertainment showbiz? I think Gambia is one of the... Uh, most underrated music scenes out there uh, you know there's a lot of talent here one thing about Gambia Gambia has a, a clear and professional sound everything that I hear come, coming out of Gambia even if it's a local artist uh, it sounds very professional it sounds very uh, something that could be a global uh, um, you know sound uh, I think that it just deserves more recognition it deserves more play and uh, I think if we can make that happen then we'll see more Gambia and artists being global artists that's right. Thank you so much and enjoy the rest of the night. Thank you very much, sir. He mentioned something very important on how underrated our artists or, or, or the entertainment scene is. Scene is in I the think Gambia. Mariam Koli, the entertainment scene here is very underrated mm -hmm. because looking at other sides of Africa, mm -hmm. we're, we're producing close to what they are producing or even way better than they are. Mm -hmm. Well, our, still, our scene is still underrated, yes. whereas theirs have blown out of the continent, mm -hmm. reaching heights that we've not yet reached. That's right. But we have a lot of talent in the Gambia. And I must note, like, just to mention, like, some of the albums, the mixtapes, the singles that have been dropping. Though a lot needs to be done, but again, they're really putting in a lot of efforts to make sure that the quality and the standards of their productions are growing and getting to, you know, better standards, especially the video, the visuals. Yeah, the visuals, yes. the visuals have been great lately. Yes. A lot of concept, you, you see visuals with storylines, yes. really, really beautiful. Great the quality. color correcting. Yes. Video directors are doing really great work That's out right. here. Just to remind our beautiful viewers, both online and of course those that are also streaming live here at the Karua Beach Hotel, it's the Wasahala Music Award and I'm Maria Makoli holding it down on the red carpet with... Alvin Alusise, your guy. Yes, so we're going to keep you company while we have our guests still coming in. You'll be, we'll be talking to artists, the celebrities which I know most people doubt if we have any, but yes, we do have celebrities and we need to celebrate them, especially tonight on this very platform. And shout out to State of Mike, they're doing the live streaming right now on Facebook. And shout outs to everyone who's coming in right now, um, especially people who came really on time. Like we were really trying to keep up with the time. People need to really come out on time and respect the time as well, which is very, very important. So we'll be talking to more people as they're coming in. The show has started. Yo, my brother is here, and one. Yo, come here, let's talk, and. Thank you. <laughs> so and one is one of those producers who was right there, you know, at the peak of the Gambian music entertainment. And all of a sudden, he just disappeared. Good to see you, and welcome back home. Yeah, thank you very much. Uh, it's a good looking uh, to see the Wasa Halat Awards. Yes. It's the first time coming. It's your first time? Yeah. Really? Yeah, exactly. <laughs> <laughs> and you're looking good, Mariama. Thank you, and Thank you, Anne. Tell us a little bit how you felt working with Gambian artists. You've worked with the likes of Manding Mori, Shiraz to you, you know, the likes of T Smalls, Rugi, the list goes on, Mighty yeah. Joe, and so many other artists that made it to the top here. Exactly. What was the feeling like working with these people? Yeah, it was all good, you know, working with all those artists, you know. All of us started from, from the beginning yes. and we make, made it all to the top, you know. It was a good feeling, you know. Uh, I did what I could, you yes. know, to help them come up, you know. Now, like the likes of T-Smalls and others, ST, they are uh, one of the best 
in the in the country. Yeah. So it's all good. So now you're a businessman. Uh, everything. <laughs> I'm doing everything. <laughs> good to see you, Anne. Yeah. Thank you so Bye. much. Yeah. All right, we have more people coming in at the Caribe Beach Hotel. It's a Wasahala Music Award. We have two amazing people here who are going to join us on the red carpet. How are you doing, guys? Yeah. Welcome. Hi, yeah. hey, how are you? Welcome, welcome, welcome. <laughs> Maria Makoli, these two? Yes. These two run an Afrofusion brand. Really? Yeah, American I think and I'm African fits. I've been following you on wide. Instagram, yes. What are your names? My name is Yankova, Jani. Hawanda, Jani. Is this your first time at the West Sahara Music Award? Yes, actually this is our first time. Yes. Tell us about your brand. Um, this brand embodied the two cultures of Africa and American fit, um, America. So um, this significantly... Um, the significance of our brand is, you know, the look of it and what it embodied. So the um, the crown and the stars, you know, this is the American flag yes. and the outline of the Africa, yeah. and we have the crown on it. So which um, simply just stating that we Africans, either you are African from Africa or African Americans, we are kings and queens. So that's what this crown stands for. Regardless of how you know we've been portrayed and looked down and trampled down from everybody, we still need to, you know, whenever we work, we have to have our heads up high because we kings and queens, we belong in that, you know, royalty, which we all have to, you know, respect and know that that's who we are. That's very important. And you, you are currently living in a country that is, you know, black people are struggling mm -hmm. with racism and mm -hmm. all of that. How are you trying to promote this? especially to non-Africans mm -hmm. that they need to really validate or actually not validate but actually mm -hmm. respect the race and not discriminate. It's been really like easy for us because we um, regardless of what you know our brand is we um, incorporate the African and American mm -hmm. so you know our brand still embody the African and the rich culture like you can see our backpacks. Yeah, it's really nice. Which details, like you can just, yeah, it details everything that has like the African, but this still will give you a look that you can wear anywhere. And that same thing applies to everything we do. So regardless of your skin color, we have people from everywhere wearing this brand. And um, we can proudly say like, this is the biggest brand in Wisconsin in the state of Wisconsin and we you know we do um, a whole bunch of fashion shows and other things so we this is our first time that we brought it to Gambia and really try to um, we've been giving out like free stuff you know t-shirts hoodies and you know a lot of Are we having things. goodies tonight? Unfortunately you haven't brought anything but I got you. All right great. I got you too so <laughs> great great yeah, so great definitely so and congratulations for being on the Fashion Weekend Gambia stage you, as well. Thank you. Thank nice you. outfits, nice displays. Thank you. I appreciate that. I hope you get to talk to Yasali so next year you can sell something here, yes, have definitely. a setup. Why not? Yeah, I'm, you know, I'm, like I said, we came this our first time trying to connect with Gambia. And we probably would go um, as far as we possibly can from the Fashion Weekend to um, Yasali Nim and everybody. Because I follow people, so I want to, you know, this is us. This is Gambia. We represent Gambia. You know, everywhere, everything that we do is just, you know, us Gambians, Africans, and, you know, on the whole, that's, that's what we do. Beautiful stuff. Thank you so much. Thank you very much. Yes. Why not? You're lucky, you're lucky to have such a man, like, really <laughs> pushing it there with you, of course, such a beautiful lady. How does it feel? Um, I think... He's the yin to my yang, so we Yay, work well together. together. <laughs> yin and yang. <laughs> yeah, That's beautiful. Guys. Well, enjoy the rest of the evening. Yeah, you, <laughs> All right, you guys enjoy. Thank you. Nice, beautiful design there. Guys, check them out. They have a link on Instagram as well, on Facebook, I believe. I've been following them for a while now. And we have a lot of young people coming up designing so many beautiful stuff. Repping the African culture, repping the African nation out there globally. And we're really proud, especially Gambians who are out there, you know, the Kunta Kintes. It, um, the, the Yanyima Konata. Yes. The Lisbon Glamours. It actually seems like it's, an, uh, it's a generation of needles and threads. Exactly. Everyone out here is fusing something else, putting out really, really beautiful outfits. Mm -hmm. 
I am pretty sure we're going to see a whole lot of amazing outfits tonight. I can't wait. I'm really excited. I can't wait to see the look, especially if So this is like stepping up your level. So you get it again, what I say. Yeah, and Fanda, Fanda <laughs> had to put up a post about it. Exactly. <laughs> Telling well them to get ready because they're going to be blasted on stage. Well, well Last I year, I they I really I got them. Not, I think not. I think <laughs> this year, they'll come prepared. This year, they will come prepared. All right. I can't wait to see what they're going to wear, but um, we are live here at the Kataba Beach Hotel. It's the fourth Wasahalat Music Award. And we have people coming in, the fans, the followers of Gambian music, and here to see what they have to put up tonight on stage. Beautiful performances will also be done. And the categories have been so challenging, especially artists of the year. Well, I believe fingers are crossed right now, Maria. Yes. Fingers are crossed. Mm -hmm. Because people out here have so much hopes on their artists winning. Everyone out here believes that they're taking the trophy home tonight. Yes. And uh, artists of the year category, oh, that's a, that's a hot one. It's a hot one. I can't wait to see who, who wins it this year it's 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 been very interesting and there's a new category uh, the people's choice, the people's choice award. Award. oh that turned <laughs> facebook wild social yes. media went wild because of that category yes. and i love the response to it how everyone thought they a particular ali mm. uh, a particular artist mm. was the people's choice exactly and indeed we essentially knew from the votes yep all right so we're gonna get more people to talk to here on the red carpet I can see some people doing selfies down there. <laughs> the beautif beautiful black queen. We'll be talking to her very soon, so you know who I'm talking about. Come over here, beauty. How you doing? She's also been working very hard and uh, did disappear a little bit and decided Aww. to come back beautiful. again. Welcome back. <laughs> yeah. What's so uh, good to see you, Lena. Thank you, thank you. I'm so happy to be here to just support my fellow Gambian artists. Yeah. You have been doing so great. I, I listened to your new single, which was released as well. Yeah. Uh, what made you disappear for a while? You know, uh, the music thing, it's like huge, huge, huge. And you, you have to disappear to just work hard. You have to disappear to just come with something big that the fan will love. They say work hard and play hard. And if you don't deliver something good, the fan will be like, wow. And I have to just disappear for a while to work hard. Yeah. Walk hard, play hard. You yeah. heard it, people. <laughs> Who did your outfit? Oh, my outfit was made by Melvin. Huh? Yeah, he did it for me. This beautiful outfit, and I'm loving it. Jungle, African. Why, you see. And this is what we have. Those your, is that your hair? Oh. Natural dreads. Whoa. How long Natural it took you to dreads. grow this? <laughs> this are not my real hair. But really? You know. It's not? It's not. God, I thought it was natural hair. <laughs> Welcome to Africa, sweetheart. I know. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Thank you, Lena. Thank you very wow, much, I Lena. I got blown away with that hair. I thought it was her natural hair. Beautiful. Look, look so African, though. Yes. Look so African. All right, so we're going to get more people to talk to. I'll leave you with Alvin for now, and I'll be right back. All right, all right, Gambia. You are watching the Wasta Halad Fort Edition. The red carpet, and I am your host tonight with Maria Makoli, Alvin Alivisisi. And tonight we are expecting a whole lot of fun, a whole lot of entertainment. People will be blown away, people will cry, people will rejoice. Your artist will win, your artist will lose as well, yeah. Because she will go. And oh, trophies are gonna go home to your house or to another person's house. So this is the third edition of the Wasa Halad Music Award for promoting good music, quality sounds, great visuals, lifetime achievement awards, people choices. You name that. Uh, I think I'll get you a person walking here, a person that's been very familiar to the scene, to come, and he will give us a hint. Super. Super, come on. Oh yeah, one more thing. Uh, if any of you have been to any events last year, either to the Black Magic, the Absolute Weekend, any of these weekends out here, you 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 realize that the the grounds were handled properly, the logistics were perfect, because of precise logics and event management team. These people are doing such a great work out here. They are actually the main reasons behind successful events, and I think these people need a special recognition award tonight for the great work that they've been doing towards Gambian events. 
making sure people get here on time, making sure that people don't sneak in and get easy entrances, making sure there are no robbery and stuff like that. Follow them on Facebook or any other social media page, Precise Events Management and Logistics. So yeah, welcome back, Mariam. Yes, so I have a very beautiful, strong mother of ours here, who is Yasalin Jai's mother, of course. Right now, Facebook Live, Facebook Live, Facebook because Papa am DJ la on. Music bi dafa yaga ci keur gi. Wa Papa am DJ la on DJ na City Pride, DJ na nakatu da Tech 5 ak yoy yep ak club bi nekkon Wadna Beach mo tuda naka bu ki la way naka wetu da. Jeng Mr. Jeng moko momon fofu la mu je DJ. Way nak ya sali dafa jok rek bu ga yef yi media I'm a journalist. I'm a In fact, first boss, I'm Peter Gomez. I'm a musician. 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 I'm a I'm a musician. 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 I'm a I'm a the far go for it. Lum miti miti. Sui joy sa dina kode. Yala dimbale kon. Shon pur limo def. Wow. Yala nyo dimbale kon ak mudo di def event bu rebi di wasa halal music award bi di ndoka le Gambian artisti ak nyu yengu si walu music entertainment bi Gambia fi. Munyo neka lu rey nak this year nyo nge celebrate fourth fourth edition bi. Yo naka nga gisi award bi ak langa ampul wah yasa. Manko wah rey mu gena gul gul lu. Because it is said that the sky is the limit. Tegumna Lulu. She's very determined. Yagana nak musician si nyo sinker di isisi di di ko johne ko sister so de me play alma. Wa for said yagana di nyo sinker gi. Wa hamon nane amna passion for the mother. Wa man ko gena nyah mu gena gor gor lu. Te hamne adi na liga irak mola muna me finga wara aga. Wa yal na ko yala tahau. Wah, tadi leh ni anak yang nyeptam, wah, yang ni anak mom, yang dia nak degar, gum cilingnya nak def, ni tu gum yang cilingnya def rek, dingko mik. Jere Jeff ya boy, kontan ini terap jere Jeff ya boy. Ya la ya gal, sun kanam si kodef, ingat tuak balik kan jere ni sista, agje keram lini def. Now we have our wonderful host for four years.